Good morning. It is 12 o'clock. I'm going to make this quick and then I'll post a normal post. This is just going to be a weird day. Um, good morning. Hopefully, or afternoon actually. Let me tell you how my morning started. Now, right now, yeah, I just put makeup on because I look like, you know, I just crawled out of a the bottom of a, a scum pond. I looked horrible. But I put on clothes, and then it, I looked down, and I was wearing dark navy blue tennis shoes, but instead of putting my heel in the tennis shoe, I just squashed, <laughs> squashed the shoe back part down. So that's navy blue, okay? Dark navy blue tennis shoes. But let me tell you what I'm wearing now. It just dawned on me, and it's a funny, so here's a funny where you're so tired, you're so fried, you're so burnt of constantly battling and fighting everything in and out you don't realize what you put on now i am wearing a light gray t-shirt this isn't bright orange it says nope and then you got the white and black this is not today so this is gray neon orange white and black with dark navy tennis shoes that i don't wear shoes in the house but here's the kicker i'll back up and show you I am wearing compression sports leggings, like I told you guys I have, but if you see, it looks orange, probably. It looks orange to me. This is not orange. That is rose pink. Rose pink. So I got rosy pink coloring on my compression leg sports leggings, neon orange, white, black, and gray. And dark navy blue tennis shoes. So that's how my morning has started. Um, I just finished doing my morning Google Glob shake. Um, it is raining outside, or it was when I was outside. I got my Breathe Easy inside my diffuser going right here beside me. I love this thing. It changes LED light, the, the colors. They're not bright, so they're a light blue, light purple, light like now it's a baby blue then it's orange and then it's green and ah uh, i love the colors turn all the lights off in the house and just let that because it's like a fiber optic which i have a fiber optic plug-in that changes colors fiber optic colors well it's like my diffuser has fiber optic optic colors and they're so soothing <laughs> so i'm enjoying that but i only turn the lights on right now for that but yeah that's my that, that's that's my morning and then I don't know it, it's been one of those days but like I said I'm going to pause this I'm going to finish my Google glob green juju and then I'll finish doing a, um, my post so till then I'll be back <clears throat> okay I'm back changed my shirt into a light pink to match with the rosy pink compression leggings i'm sorry i went dumb um yeah i've been severely pale recently so i'm actually been putting makeup on because i look like the walking dead they really need to put us in that show we 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 wouldn't need nothing but ragged torn clothing because we already go uh so um but now I had been watching tutorials because I rarely <laughs> wear makeup unless I'm really, really pale. But I've been watching these tutorials on YouTube about makeup. And I did one yesterday. Oh, that one was funny. You listen to the tutorial and don't watch it. And um, put your makeup on just listening, not watching. Oh, my Lord. I look like a, like a raccoon going out standing on the side street waiting to get money <laughs> that one was hilarious so i'm like nope not gonna do this i'm gonna do it my way so but here's a kicker in case you guys didn't know this this is to get to know you i guess um right now i'm okay um i woke up feeling like the um the br blood brain barrier medicine I, it was like somebody was nailing hot nails pounding hot nails through my head it was like uh -huh -huh, this morning no 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 so i went back to bed at six 
Woke up at 4.30, went back to bed at 6, woke up at 10, and it's fixed to be 1 o'clock now. Um, so, I'm like, this is not going to work because you got to take it on an empty stomach, which, hey, that's fine. So, I got up this morning after that, and I'm like, I need energy. My head felt a little bit better, but, <laughs> so, um, took some of my Korean Panics Ginseng. And it's now kicking in. I'm waiting for the time release. Blood brain barrier medicine to kick in. So I'm loop de doop -de. But um, here's you get to know. You guys always, most of us women, this is for the women, not you men, because none of you have long hair. <laughs> but uh, if you do, n nothing against it. But you guys always see my hair always up. And when you do see my hair down, it's usually straight because I straight iron it. And I'm going to let you in on a secret. Now, I know, Jen, you've got straight hair. I've never seen it curly. I think, Tracy, your hair is pretty much straight unless you curl it. But this is, I had took a bath last night, went to bed. This is every night when I when I go to bed, no matter how many times I wash it or whatever, I've got to, i got to always straighten iron it. And this is the reason why. Now, I took a shower last night, washed my hair. Yay, I got a, I got a shower. Um, didn't put it up, just, you know. Combed it out straight, dried it out straight, it was still a little damp, put my leave-in conditioner in it, and went to bed. This is why you guys never see my hair down. I am natural, kinky curly, and I'm going to show you why, and then I'm going to put it back up. Because this is what I wake up to with my hair, and yes, I'm getting off the little line, line because sometimes we need a good laugh, and this is a good laugh, because... This is why nobody sees my hair down. But I'm going to show you. I got to. I love pencils. I, I miss. I cannot find any. If Also, ladies, this is my question. Um, you can buy those chopsticks. Not the eating ones, which they're good to use too. But they've got the metal chopsticks where you can put them up in your hair and use them. I lost mine through so many moves. So if anybody knows where to find some, and I don't mean the hair clips. My hair is too long, and when I clip it up, I still got dangles. Um, so if anybody knows where you can find the chopsticks, the metal chopsticks you can put in your hair. Otherwise, I'm going to have to go to a Chinese restaurant and sneak some Chinese sticks out. Let me know, because I love those things better than hair clips. Because hair clips, just my hair just ain't going to do it. Now, steal my hair's back. Now, this is washed. But this is why I do not let you guys see my hair down. Literally. I am a natural puff daddy. <laughs> now, I can... Yes, this is the comical of this day. I love it. I do. But on a hot, humid, rainy day, this stuff goes all out. I mean, literally. Look at this. But this is my natural hair. Kinky. Real kinky. I mean, big kinky curls, like you can see them back here. But that's my natural hair. Um, not straight as a board, because like I said, it's straight as a board is because I'm, a, um, um, what's that thing? <laughs> not drawing it. Straightening it. I'm straightening it so you never get to see this, but here's the comical of today. That's my natural hair wave. Kinky, baby. Kinky. And talking about, yeah, I'm getting everywhere. My husband, <clears throat> my husband won't leave me alone today. He's at work, and I guess they're not doing much today. So, he's being a little naughty today <laughs> at work. Yeah, TMI there, but I don't care. Sometimes we need to let, open the door sometimes, and let the laughter out. Yes, I, this is all brought to you by laughter, because... Without laughter through this disease and all these complex, uh, idiot things we've got to fight. Ugh, man, we'd be another statistic on Suicide Watch. I mean, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, I'm using the, my coloring pencils. Aqua green <laughs> coloring pencil. Um, 
to hold my hair up since I have lost my metal chopsticks. But yes, ladies, if you've got long hair, which I know Jen does, Tracy does. I don't know whoever else puts their hair up. If you know where to get those metal chopsticks you can put in your hair, you know, because you can also use them as weapons. Please let me know because I can't find them. Unless I, I now I'm not looked online at all. Um, <coughs> so, but yeah, there's the comical. But like I said, sometimes we've got to get off track and go, okay, this is what Lime has given me. This is what Lime what I'm going to have to live with day in and day out for the rest of my life because there ain't going to be no cure for no chronic -y. Chronic limey, I mean. So, I'm trying to, on the good points, on the good sucky lime days, I am trying to find laughter through it. Like my husband finds laughter with me, Yoda baby. <laughs> you know, I'm just all out there. But I will tell you one thing. Last night, I'm having all day freakazoid <laughs> not thinking right my husband sat down because he he like i told you guys he had worked on his motorcycle getting the a new stator put in had to go to the store two times one two two times to finally because it says an inch and a half to fit the nut it wasn't an inch and a half any of that that's the only nut uh, um, deep socket we didn't have we had the inch it was a little too small then we had the 30 millimeter or 30 centimeter. I don't know which one. If it fits, that's what works. I just remember the number. It fit, but it was a little too t loose. So I said, you need to either get whatever's between an inch and an inch and a half or get a 29. That's what I told him last night. But to round that up, he did finally get the new stator on. He had to call me out there. He's like, Please, will you fish this through the hole? So, you know, because if you have a motorcycle, Bill, I know you do. If you've ever had to do it, it goes through this little itty bitty hole. So he tied a rope or a string to it and I had to pull it out and then pull it back through for him. Because it took two people to do that part. But mindless to say, he did get that finally on. It's charging. Well, no, it's not charging. He's having to pick up new oil for, um, since he had to drain oil. It's a big old process. Had to drain all the oil, so he's putting new oil in it. He's picking up new oil this afternoon. I'm like, okay, good. So, and then there should be no more problems. We did order um, the gel foam. It's three and a half inch um, gel foam, two and two inch memory foam, and it works with the weather. If it's hot, it's cool. If it's cold outside, it warms up. So I'm like. Oh, this is going to be awesome because I told him, I'm like, I can't ride this thing. I'm like, my hoo-ha goes numb and my back starts hurting. And then when I get off of it, everything on my body for two days is vibrating. <laughs> I'm like, you're going to have to get a better seat. And he's like, yeah, let's get one because, you know, it'll get, long rides will get you numb. <laughs> <And> so... <laughs> As far as I'm going on that one. So, um, it was 104 or $107 for the Harley Davidson seat that fits it. And, um, it'll actually attach to that one. So, it's going to be, that one's a two inch thick seat on top of the three and a half inch memory foam. I mean, cool cooling or heating foam. And then the memory foam, two inch. So it's like, oh yeah, I'm gonna be jacked up now. I'm gonna be way up here. Now can you raise the the backrest for me? And then we good. <laughs> so he, mine. Let's just say he got his motorcycle dealt with. He just got to put um, new oil in it. Um, woke up to well, when I woke up this morning at ten, it was raining. It's not raining right now. Mosquitoes are out there driving me nuts. Ah, but um. If I, I, I don't, I think if it wasn't for the Asian or Korean panics ginseng mixture I got going on right now, I'd be a lost cause taking this brain barrier medicine because I could tell it works because I start feel I, I get the side effects of how you know it's starting to work. And my thing is, is I'm not going to like when I have a die off from it because like I said, when I did the brain wake. Uh, mixture I did have a die off 30 days 28 30 days later it wasn't fun so and this is a lot stronger than that and it's just works specifically for the crossing the blood brain barrier 
the it works on the metabolism, energy, brain fog, memory issues. I, I'll never get my memory back. I don't think I'll ever be clear of brain fog, to be honest, or a Yoda baby. Yes, Yoda baby. <laughs> That's what I'm going to call myself. Yoda baby. I'm backwards. So, um, I don't think I'll ever be cured from that because I'm so chronic with that. And I've had too many, many strokes and all this. And um, between the it, my MRI showing the Lyme or Bartonella Borella um, in my brain when I've had the scans, I don't really think I'll ever get rid of it. But I'd like to find a, a balance of, yeah, I'm going to have these bad days, but yet I'm going to have those, woo! I'm going to have fun, but I'm going to be Yoda <laughs> all at the same time. But, um, no, it's just you got to take each day at a time. I mean, like right now, my bones this morning were screaming in pain. But I'm like, I can't do nothing about it. All I can do is find the best thing to help me get through it until it eases or eases off. And that's all you could do. You you get in your toolbox. You go, where's my ice packs? Where's my heat pads? Where's my weighted, uh, your weighted blanket or your anything to get through the issues or the headaches, the migraines, <laughs> all that stuff. And all you can do is get in your toolbox and, and just flow with it, work with it until it eases. And yes, we're going to cry through it. Yes, we're going to be frustrated, fed up, done, just ready to go. <laughs> That's how I'm going to put that. But then that makes you sad. That makes you depressed. That makes you down. That makes you beat yourself up more than you already are beat up. So then you, I go, no, I can't do this. I can't do this because otherwise I'm going to have to get on my happy here. You, you, it's all in your head. So take these. <laughs> I don't want to do that. And, um, so I look at the laughter of it. Yeah, my bones hurt, but guess what? I put on clothes that <laughs> rose colored, black, gray, or neon orange, and navy blue. <laughs> I wore mismatch. Didn't care until I realized what I was wearing. And I'm like, no. I I'd be a, a laugh. I'd be laughed at if I kept it that way. So, and I got to laugh at myself about that. You've got to laugh at the little things. Of what this has done. Yeah, it, it's it's closed us in and it's made us so paranoid of almost everything. But it's like, well, it's, I'm glad I don't like being around people anymore. There, there ain't nothing but germs. They germs. They are, what was it called when we were, cooties. Normal humans are cooties. <laughs> That's how I'm going to put that. Normal people are cooties. I don't want them. <laughs> I don't want it. And then sometimes you don't mind mingling with the cooties as long as the cooties stay with them. <laughs> Keep your cooties, but I'll, I'll, I'll hang with you. And then you've got those moments where, well, I'm glad I don't like people. I want to be alone. I need to rest my brain, my body, my, my self. I need to think about me and help me heal me. Try and get me to something okay. You know, so, I mean, it's okay to play with the cooties. <laughs> but it's also okay not to be around the cooties. And it does give you a bigger perspective of life. It really does. You know, I mean, I, you can't do the things. And Lord, I'd love to go back and start climbing mountains and climb trees and exercise. And be an adrenaline junkie from everywhere but I can't but yet when I have those good moments is when I go oh I feel good let's go 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 and then I pay for it and that's okay I know I'm gonna pay for it but I'm gonna I'm gonna take that good feeling and I'm gonna run with it no matter what I have to deal with later also guys let you know the full moon is I think Thursday I think it's Thursday so <laughs> We all should be feeling the effects of the full moon coming this week. Um, but no, just I'm going to start bringing more laughter into this crazy disease and its complexity of co-infections. 
Because we look at, you can look at someone and go, oh, they don't look sick, but we are. We're just having a good moment or a good day. Tomorrow, we look like we, you know, got threw up and condors and <laughs> sitting. You know, we look like horrible and can't hardly walk and think and talk and all that. So, I mean, and when I do feel good, I'm going to bring the joy and the the good out of yes I've got this but I, what am I going to do I'm going to laugh about it I'm going to laugh why yes I'm sorry you guys are constipated but I ain't got no problems I got straight up diarrhea for a year have fun <laughs> you know or I've got a migraine that's been with me for a week you 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 have what you had a headache what's a headache I know what a migraine is. I know what hemiplegic migraines are. I know what they are. What's a headache? Ha ha ha. That headache must be bad because <laughs> I want your headache. You can have what I got. Or I've got a cold. I live with the flu symptoms. 24-7. <laughs> you can get help. You can take an antibiotic and go, Woo, I feel good. Three to five days later with a follow-up we go to a doctor's we can't find nothing wrong with you mr. or mrs. whoever you are but here's your saline bag and here's you some antibiotics that are going to make it worse tear us down because that's what antibiotics do they tear you down I mean you got to rebuild yourself when you I can't even you're not even rebuildable at the moment but you'll get better wait a minute do you not want to know what chronic Lyme is Chronic means chronic. Your little antibiotic pill ain't going to help me. So, you got to laugh. And, I mean, <coughs> that's why I stopped going to doctors. I, uh, me and Leon has decided that we are going to go the full herbal way. The tinctures, the essential oils. Yes, I'll have to put supplements in pill form, but I'm going to break them. I'm going to cut them and put them in like whatever juice I can drink at the time since they since it will get in my system better since the pill is going one in and out the other so um, that's what I'm having to do but yeah we have agreed that yeah I don't want to do the doctor route of here get on this for your neuropathy get on this for the migraines get on this for your heart get on this for here's your breather for your lungs here's this for your brain but which is psychotic medicine here's this for your back and you, then you'd be set up like I was before 15 different medications and half the time you're having to double up on them because they don't freaking work so we agreed that we're gonna do the holistic herbal way we are sticking with the young lady that I've been going to you know the stress teas the tinctures and all that um, she does have a massage room and all that stuff and, and we're gonna get into getting that set up for me so I can at least once a week go and get um, start off with tea touch since you know if you deep massage your body it actually activates releases toxins then you're <laughs> damn so um, we are gonna do just the holistic and herbal way since they do have the um, nature's way oh, I can't even, natural naturalistics nurture path the nature path here and then I've got the young lady helping me with all the herbs and the tinctures and everything so we've decided to do that since I'm seeming to find my niche of what I need to take and how much I need to take I mean I'm still we're still having to look for the issue of the bone pain or the deep deep muscle pain that is the number one contender I'm always contending to and if I take a lot of turmeric, and I mean spoonfuls, it eases it, but it don't keep it eased long enough. So I told him, I'm like, that's probably the one thing I may have to go to a doctor's to get a prescription for is back to get back on gabapentin because that was the only thing that helped with the bone pain and the deep, deep muscle pain that you just can't get to. And I'm like, that would probably be the only thing, or Lyrica, that helps too. Or we're going to have to look for um, a good muscle, deep muscle and bone pain 
So um, we're going this weekend, or I'm going, we're going, I don't know, uh, to go and see and do some testing because she has a, a roll-on for deep muscle tissue pain, and I'm going to end up trying that over the weekend and see how that works. Now, if my husband massages my legs, the deep, deep mesh, um, it, it does help it. Uh, it's become a normal where he's having to massage my legs just so I can sleep or rest. So we're going to try the this deep muscle tincture roll on. You roll it on and then you can massage it in. Um, we're going to try that and see how that works on top of doing the turmeric. Because I had the turmeric supplements and the turmeric powder. I put turmeric in my everything. So um, see how that works before I really have to step in to go back to getting a prescription to help for that but hey or the neuropathy I am waking up with the neuropathy constantly in my arms mostly my right one and I can feel why it like right here it's actually right here I laid on my right side in it my bone right here is very tender and when I press on it it immediately my arm goes numb and I woke up this morning my whole arm was just when I woke up and walked, I hit the wall, I leaned, or as my husband says, honey, why are you walking to the left? I did not realize it, but he said recently, I've been, when I get up and start walking, I'm not walking straight, I'm actually veering over, I'm causing my, it's like, here you are, and you're supposed to walk straight, but I'm literally like this, but I think I'm going like this, but I'm actually walking this way. And I'm supposed to be going this way. And I'm not realizing it. <coughs> so obviously I'm walking to the left. Trying to walk straight. So I'm like, well, I'll just start doing this. It, it'll lead me to where I'm going to go sooner or later. It'll get me there. But, <laughs> I mean, what can you say? But no, other than that, uh, it's an okay. My, my panic ginseng is kicking in. I have not took my turmeric yet. I need to go in there and take that. Um. It's an okay day. I, I've had a one of those mixed up nope days. Really mixed up. Didn't realize what I was wearing days. And just enjoying life even though it, it it's not a normal life. And trying to find humor and laughter in through all this. And I've always been that person. I've got to find the humor and the laughter of all the situation. S situations. Uh, because I, I, I can't be the Debbie Downer. I just can't. So I've always got to find the humor in the situation, in the issue at hand. And I always try to do that. And I'm just, I, I'm, I'm, I'm actually doing more of looking back onto what I'm doing and it's make it it's a great comedy to me it's like we need to make this into a movie cuz you're comical and don't even realize it so i'm laughing at the stupidity and the stupid i do and don't even realize i'm doing it and so i have got to laugh through all this pain and hell we go through and that's it, laughter is the best medicine it's the what best way to get through it all um other than that, I'll probably post later again this afternoon. But right now, i got to get in here and take my turmeric. <sighs> you know, suck spoonfuls of that down. And just chill for the day. But I love you. Look for the shimmy, the shake, the sprinkle, the sparkle, and the silver lining. I'm alive. I'm finding humor in my day. That's my silver lining. And my biggest silver lining, it dawned on me. I was four times. I, I, I dressed myself. In the dark, obviously, when my eyes closed, <laughs> or I was colorblind when I dressed myself this morning. So my silver lining is it dawned on me. I went back to seeing color and realized what I was wearing, because like you guys saw, that was a get up from colorblind world. <laughs> so, other than that, let me know down in the comments how is your day. Also, I want to thank you for the new subscribers. I do have quite a few new subscribers. So, I'm um, all my new subscribers. Hit, um, make sure you, after you hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell on the side so you can get a notification every time I post a video. I also have my second channel, Liming Around, that's here on YouTube. I haven't really been posting on it because I really just decided to condense it all to one 
channel, whether it's me singing, whether it's <laughs> whatever it is, I just do it on here. So, unless it's Facebook. But I want to thank you again for all the subscribers. Remember to hit the little bell so you can get notified of each time, which is usually daily. Usually daily. Um, other than that, I love you guys. God bless. My prayers are with you all. <sighs> Hopefully, you all are having a lessened painful day, less symptoms. And remember, if it's a bad day, laugh about it. Find the humor in it. I don't care if it's because you're stuck on a toilet all day. Find humor in it. <laughs> Find humor. Because laughter is the best medicine. God bless you guys. Till the next time. Be good.